Hello, good day viewers. Welcome once again to a Summon of Goodwill Online Maths. In our tutorial today, I will just simplify the question I posted on my page for us to solve. Please, if today is your first time of visiting this page, kindly consider subscribing to a Summon of Goodwill Online Maths. That's my YouTube page. So if you observe this, using the elimination method to solve this equation, you can see that I have a 3 minus y equal to 23 for the equation 1. I have 2x plus 5y equal to 4 for the equation 2. So for us to be able to eliminate any of this constant, but for me, I will eliminate x first. So for us to eliminate x, we have to make the coefficient of x, the 2x here, to be equal so that we can either subtract or add as the case may be. So for us to make these two equal, we have to multiply equation 1 by, by 2 and equation 2 by 3. So we write equation 1 times 2 and equation 2 times 3. So you can see that 2 times 3x is 6x, 2 times minus y is minus 2y equal to 2 times 23 is 46. We'll move to equation 2. You can see that 2 times 2x is 3 times 2x is 6x. 3 times 5y is plus 15y. 3 times 4 is 12. So since we have gotten to this extent, we can easily say equation 1 minus equation 2 so that we can be able to eliminate uh, x. So 6x minus 6x is 0. Minus 2y minus 15y is minus 17y equal to 46 minus 12. 46 minus 12 is equal to 34. Then I can decide to divide through by 17 minus 17 so that I can know actually the value of y. So once I divide by 7 minus 17, I'm having that my y is equal to this divide is 2, this divide is 1, dividing through by 17. So you can see I have my y to be equal to minus 2 because we divided by a negative number. Then since my y is, is now equal to minus 2, then I can say put, I can put my y equal to minus 2 in equation 1. Our equation 1 from the equation is 3x minus y equal to 23. Then putting y to be minus 2, I have 3x minus minus 2 equal to 23. Then I have that 3x minus minus is positive, positive 2 equal to 23. So I can say subtract 2 from both sides. I have 3x equal to 23 minus 2. So you have that 3x is equal to 21. So I can divide through by 3, divide through by 3, because 3 is the coefficient of x. So that 3 divided 3 is 1, 3 divided 21 is 7. Then you can see that my x is equal to 7. Therefore, the value of x is equal to 7, and the value of y is equal to minus 2. So thank you, I remain blessed. So if you got the, your answers to be 7 and minus 2, that's the correct answer. Thank you, and have a wonderful day ahead.